Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a what's in my gym bag slash diaper bag. It's mainly a diaper bag at this point. My little girl is a little over nine months old. She is now going to the gym childcare center, whether that's with my husband and myself or just my husband or just me, whatever. And it just felt really silly juggling three bags between the three of us and trying to carry her in. So I consolidated my gym bag, which already was a backpack, and her diaper bag all into one. This is a diaper bag. It's the Lululemon New Parent Backpack. It is fabulous. Uh, we'll get into it, obviously. But I actually had the Mina Bay backpack first. Very expensive. I love it. It's beautiful, it's big, it holds enough stuff because I clearly always have a lot with me. I always have my vlog camera. Tons of stuff and babies if you leave the house with them. You, you already have a lot. So I liked that bag, it fit a lot, but it was really heavy. This one, I mean, it's heavy because I have it filled to the brim, but the bag itself is way lighter because it's more of that like water repellent material. The other one was a leather bag. Long story short, I've been loving this. I've traveled with this one and now it is my main gym bag, diaper bag, whatever you mainly wanna call it. Before we get into this, I did wanna mention there's gonna be a giveaway in here. I already gave away one of these on Instagram on my Closet by Cal account. I'm currently waiting on the winner to choose which color she wants. So whichever color she doesn't choose, you will, one of you will get to have. There's a black one, obviously, exactly what mine looks like, and then gray sage, which we all love, still in the bag, but very, very neutral. It is obviously a little lighter than black, but I still don't think this is gonna show much dirt. They're easy to clean. All you have to do to enter to win the bag is just be subscribed, comment below, and follow me on Instagram, Kaylin Yeager, and I will choose one of you probably like two days after this video goes up. But without further ado, let's get into what is in this beautiful bag. Starting with the top. This is one of my favorite features of the bag. Probably sounds silly, but it has this little zipper pocket up here that is not so little. It's like the whole top. And I carry my little wallet in here. So this just has some cards, like my main credit card, debit card, cash, change, whatever I need. It's just easy to pop this in and out of a belt bag or into here or into a nice purse if Chris and I are going out. So I love that, it's easy right on the top. And I like that no one else can really access it because it is like right up against my body. I have like a, a normal wallet. I don't ever really use it anymore just cause this is so convenient, but I think I could fit my normal wallet up here because it is so big. So that's the first zipper pocket. Staying on the outside, we have two very deep pockets, which I love. So like most of us, I usually have my water bottle on one side and then my other side, I'll normally put my phone so I have easy access to it and my keys. And then I have this front pocket up here. Once again, because this is my gym bag and my diaper bag, everything's kind of jumbled up. I feel like I have it pretty well organized. It's at least organized enough for me. So up here, I'm obsessed with gum. So I have gum. You always have to have a minty option and a sweet option. Uh, I prefer the spearmint, that's the green one. That's the one I normally have, not that that really matters, but if I'm showing you what's in here, that's what's normally in here. The juicy fruit, starburst strawberry, love it. There's a little mesh divider in here, so I have the gum in there, and then I have little pacifier wipes. I've just had these in here since we were traveling, and I feel like that's just something good to have, even though I always have uh, baby wipes in here as well. I have some little lotion for the baby, some Aquaphor, some chapstick for myself. Uh, when we travel, I'll normally have her little medicines up here as well, once again, so it's like easily accessible if we need it. And then moving in to the main part of the bag. Oh, I forgot to bring up. This bag also comes with a little crossbody. If I'm traveling, I'll have all of her diaper stuff in the crossbody, so it's easy to just pull out. Um, and then like when we were traveling, it was really nice because I would just take the crossbody to dinner. So it had all of her stuff rather than lugging around the big bag. That's downstairs, I think though. Starting in the back pocket, we have the changing pad. This comes with the bag, which is really nice. So this comes with the bag as well as that crossbody. This one's bigger than the pad that comes with the Mina Bay one too, which is nice. The Mina Bay one is more like of a like memory foam, or not memory foam, like a neoprene kind of material. But this one's really nice, folds up really nice, and it has the elastic on there to keep it shut. 
I also have some books in here. These are still in here from when we were traveling. I don't really need those, but we did need them for our nighttime routine when we were traveling and she's now getting into where she likes to play with books. So whatever, those are in there. And then we have the main diaper section. So I have her wipes. I have plenty of diapers in here, all in the like second back pocket, I guess you would say. There's a total of six pockets in here. Five of them are the mesh pockets. So there's one on each side, two in the front, one in the back, and then this big pocket in the back. I guess we'll go through my stuff first. So the one side pocket I leave for little things I need. This is dry shampoo. I'm not someone who showers at the gym. I don't know why, but our gym actually now has shampoo, conditioner, body wash, deodorant, like they have everything there. So I figure if I am going to shower there, I, I don't shower enough to where I feel like I need all my own stuff. I can just use theirs, but I do like having dry shampoo. If I have to go somewhere after a workout and I'm looking, uh, this will at least clean up my hair a little bit, make my hair look a little bit better. I have little uh, recovery balls, I think is what Lululemon calls these. I'm missing the third one. I don't know where it is. I thought it was in here and it is not. So I don't have to find that, but I like these for rolling out my shoulders, rolling out my back, my glutes. I have a resistance band. This one actually came in a three pack. I love it. Three different resistance. So there's a, you know, light, medium, and difficult. I just keep the light one in here. I feel like you can very easily underestimate a resistance band. And then you go to do like banded clamshells or something. And you're like, why is this so difficult? So I always keep the lightest one in here because I feel like I can do the most exercises with it. The heaviest ones, I'm always very limited to what exercise I can do with it because it is so heavy. So resistance band to add to exercises. And then the last thing that's really for me in here is kind of a catch-all. I've had this bag for forever. <laughs> this is what houses basically everything I could possibly need. Tampons, uh, yeah, we have some tampons. We have a hair tie or a headband. Hair ties, a uh, little perfume. Chris got me perfume for Christmas and didn't realize it came with like a little travel one or like gift one. And this got delivered first and he unpackaged it. And he was like, you've got to be kidding me. I spent so much on this and this is the size of the perfume. It was really funny. Uh, but I got the big one and this one. So this one is a perfect gym one. I haven't used it yet. I have an immunity packet. Like literally everything is in here. More chapstick, uh, little floss sticks face lotion, some change. I have a thumb drive. <laughs> it's a great catch-all. Kind of like the little wallet I keep in the top of this. It's just nice to have stuff like this put together. So when I'm transferring bags, which I do pretty often at this point, I can just grab two things instead of grabbing like everything individually. So this has basically everything I need, which is lovely. This fits perfectly all the way at the bottom. And then moving into the other little pockets, I have a bottle. She hardly ever needs a bottle when we're out because I'm still breastfeeding her. And typically we're not leaving the house unless she has just eaten and we don't go far or we're, we're never gone long enough to where I, I would really need a bottle. But for traveling purposes, I always have one just in case. Uh, when we were traveling, I also had my pump. Next pocket, I have diaper cream and then I have a change of clothes. This is the cutest thing ever for Christmas. I got her obviously toys, duh. And they had a little weightlifting set. So one of her toys is a little blender bottle. How adorable is that? So she's got a toy in here, her change of clothes, just in case she spits up or has a blowout, knock on wood. We haven't had a blowout in a long time. Next pocket, so now we're on to the side. Uh, we have some snacks a burp cloth just in case. We hardly ever use burp cloths anymore, but we used to run through them. Uh, I have some food. I have to replace her spoon that was in here. There's usually a spoon in here. So yeah, snack, food, just in case. She normally, we give her snacks like right after we pick her up from the childcare center. We'll just go into the cafe and we'll eat, she'll eat. It's great. So then she's happy on the car ride home. I think that's about it. Yeah, that's that's everything that's in my gym bag. The only thing that's missing is my camera, but I'm using it right now. So that fits perfectly on the top. And then once again, it does come with the crossbody. I like that a lot. It has a back zipper pocket and then the 
uh, main crossbody has a divider down the middle, but I normally will just have a changing pad, her wipes, diapers, diaper cream, and then in the back, I'll put my little, this little wallet. So out of everything, this is great. <laughs> I love it. And my little catch-all bag because it's just, once again, very easy to grab and go. So that is what is in my gym bag. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. I recorded one of these like three years ago, probably maybe even longer. So I figured it was time to do an updated one. And the fact that it's a diaper bag and a gym bag, I figured it would be just a one-stop shop. Hopefully you found it helpful. The other thing I feel like I should mention, it does have the band on the back. So when you're traveling, it can slide over your luggage. Love that. The Mina Bay one does have that, but it's like a little hidden zipper pocket on the bottom. The main thing I like about these is they're so lightweight compared to a lot of the other ones I've tried in terms of how much they hold. Like I feel like these ones hold the most for the least amount of weight if that makes sense. <laughs> so little reminder, all you have to do to enter to win the new parent backpack is subscribe to my YouTube channel, comment down below and follow my Kaylin Yeager Instagram. And I will choose someone two days from when this video goes up so I give people enough time to enter. But thank you so much for watching the video. I am gonna go head off and have lunch with my dad and my grandparents to celebrate my grandpa's birthday. Happy birthday, grandpa. But I will see you guys in the next video.